This week's affirmation is, I choose not to be offended when someone disagrees with me. And today is the first step to being able to overcome these feelings of offense. And that first step is really to dive into why it's important to you personally, why you personally do not want to have these feelings of offense. Okay, it could be that it's making you feel frustrated and irritated and unsettled. Uh, it could be that you want to see, you want to love others. You want to see them as a child of God and to not judge them for the different things that they believe, but to really seek to understand them in a way that, that you can see them as God sees them and be able to feel that love for them that God has for them. Okay, so what I want you to do today is to take the time to write out why it's important to you to not have these feelings of offense. And getting really clear on your why will help you to have a greater desire about it. Now, one thing that can help you to remember why is to take a moment and envision yourself with with someone else who disagrees with you and envision you embracing this idea of not being offended by them even if they disagree. So how would you see yourself responding? How would you be thinking about them? What are some of the thoughts that you would be having towards them? Would you be able to see them as a child of God? Would you be able to see them as someone who has been through a lot? And would you be able to see their strengths and their strength to overcome? Would you wonder what experiences that they have seen or had that have led them to the beliefs that they have? Would you seek to be understood? or to understand, how would you feel towards them? Okay, so taking this time to really envision and imagine how you want to show up when someone disagrees with you can help you to be more prepared in that moment and can also help to remind you why it is that you want to be someone who does not get offended. All right, so that's it for today. Please take some time to write down the insights that you had. And if you have any comments, please let me know. I would love to hear your comments as well.